This is Booba and Kiki. Can you tell who is who? The majority of people tend to agree that this is Booba and this is Kiki. This is a well-established cross-modal correspondence effect based on visual and linguistic features. But what happens if we take away vision and use smell and touch instead? Do shapes have corresponding smells? We made tangible 3D printed versions of Booba and Kiki, hid them away, and asked children between the ages of 10 and 17 to do two tasks. In a first experimental setup, decide how to associate vanilla and lemon scents with angular and rounded shapes, we used neutral cylinder shape and air as controls, and in the second experimental setup, decide how to associate the stimuli with emotional dimensions of balance, activation, and confidence. We found associations between angular shape, lemon scent and arousing emotion, and between rounded shape, vanilla scent and calming emotion. We also identified four strategies of associations from a qualitative analysis of post-test interviews, based on the sense of pleasantness, on personal connections, on connection to real or imagined locations, and on geometrical features. We reflect on how these findings could be used to design richer and more inclusive multisensory interactive experiences, particularly to engage visually impaired and sighted children. We therefore present the first study of the cross-modal Bubatiki paradigm in concurrent presentation of tactile olfactory stimuli. These findings extend research on cross-modal and multisensory interactions in terms of sample, modalities, and task.